the head or if he's just... Oh! Sa February 24, darating ang paghukom sa bansang Japan. Jonas Alta! Dalawa sa mga magigiting na mandirigma mula Pilipinas ang tutulak patungong Land of the Rising Sun para wakasan ang kamalasan sa sigalot ng pinakamahukusay na boksingero sa kontinente ng Asia. Jerwin Pretty Boy ang kahas at Jonas One Punch Zoro Sultan kontra Takuma Inoue at Riku Masuda. Ikahos ngayon ang perlas ng silangan sa kampiyonato at ngayon pa lamang mapuputol ang sumpa. Bago ang main event na ang Kahas vs. Inoue para sa WBA World Bantamweight title, mag-ahasik muna ng lagim sa kokogikan Tokyo, Japan si Jonas Sultan. May 11 knockouts sa labing siyam na panalo at may anim na talo ang veteranong kartada ni Sultan. 3 wins, 1 loss and with 3 victories by way of knockout naman, ang pasibol na ring record ni Rico Masuda. Natalo nga si Masuda sa kanyang huling laban samantalang panalo naman ang ating kababayang si Sultan. Narito ang kanilang huling ring performances para magkaalaman kung sino talaga ang malakas. against the now WBA Bantamweight World Champion. And how he's performed. And that title fight against Paul Butler. He was fighting for a world title in his last fight. Ah. And is he... Ah. In the body. Ah. Ah. Smart tactic from... Ah. Mike Goldberg, a powerful partner, the former world champion. And man, he talked about the aggressiveness. Ah. 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 his head so much, but those are the the show this kid is built for power yeah very super explosive with an uppercut i mean beautiful transition rodriguez and 15 and one at the time you know in the last fight but not there it is again slowly close and, and the, uh, the answer's got to be automatic if you're filipino right so, the olympics that jonas says yeah he can still do it from that uppercut from so far away i know he's explosive but there's a lot of opportunities to close right hands nicely throwing the uppercut from, from pretty far away there you go Boom. ole round number three if jabs go up the round look at the about outside of his home country, his fourth year in... means the Punisher. He has fought in Mexico. And here in this round. So he's having a good round of uh, boxing here. Although he just ate a big... Three distinct speeds. Fast and faster. <laughs> <laughs> a guy like Sultan. Either the slider or the fastball, right? Yeah, basically. Change-ups on the fly. Yep. The battle continues. Wrestle Bantamweight champion. That's just a couple. Well, he knows what he's doing there. He knows the game plan. He just got a guy in front of him that's very difficult to deal up. That's impressive. That's a press impressive athletic maneuver. Just a power frame. Now the fight is locked in against Frank Martin, so that's good for the vacant WBC Lightweight World Championship. Final 30 seconds, round number four. Yeah, Salty, he's not the prettiest boxer in the world, but he is effective. Because he has given Frank Gonzalez no space. 
you, you would think of that looking at those. Uh, I definitely would. It's boxing, I promise. Oh, I like that, right hand, that right hand down. A guy like Sultan, where you have those distinct on and off periods in the round, loading, he's jumping in with those uppercuts from the outside. You put a right hand on that, he'll... That's why fainting is so important, especially. Himself up. Oh, right back at the top of the ladder. Hit with two shots while he was down. This yeah. this could be a real issue. But it was two oh, hard okay. shots that you. came back. It's not twice when he was down, Chris. Two points. Two point deduction. This round. Finds a home for that. See the uppercut, then left hook there. Catches him, and then some shots. Great job, great command. A black, purple trunks for Frank Gonzalez. Fight scheduled for eight. Against an opponent who has also fought for some hot challenge. I had to deal with. It's an average of about seven rounds per fight. Great fitness. He's still explosive here in, in round number six. Chris. Yeah, and I was mentioning that Carlos Calabayo fight, which did go 10. He scored like five. And mentally, Sultan hasn't changed. Short and power shots. It's, whether it's the right, it's the left, it's the uppercut. Oh, yes, it is. Opening. You get a little. The hood. Seventh round. Inside. And the brute force of salt in that Collis was at the time. Oh no, he's, he's obviously a capable. Yeah. Not to mention he's in phenomenal shape, but he, he wants another title shot. I would say the greatest intangibles experience. How you would react to before they happen in fight three, ten, four. To get you set way more economic in his professional career. Body in a nest. Frank Gonzalez, a huge fan. Gonzalez has something that he can utilize here in the throw. I mean, he's not wrong, but I don't know. I mean, Sultan is in 171 and counting rounds. But also, very, very soon. Oh, big left hook to the liver. Anyways, starting with just his physical condition. He makes you gun shy as an yes. opponent, and we're seeing that because Gonzalez, who's true, look at the real estate of where they're where they're, they're fighting or playing. Yep. Punch Zorro has landed about a hundred. Gonzalez on his heels, which is so strong in the inside, which makes it something with a big one. They, they go the distance with the official decision. So に百七十八センチの不正百六十八センチのマスタということで。で、KO率が高いんですよね。百二十二。二千十九年には国体のフライ級でも準優勝を飾っているという。ご覧のようにこの試合二人とも十四選手で十二勝二敗。さっき当た
前で打つ人が、あのー、自信持って打つ人が大事だと思います、はい、ラストのパンチです結構右でコントロールして、左側でコントロールして、足もうまく使いながらマスター、アッパーを突き上げていく、さあここは距離を詰めてお互いにうまくぶれないですね、はい、怖いですよね、えー、やっぱりトップ選手とかないと、もう顔色一つ変えずに、えー、自分のあイメージですなるほど、跳ねないでいく。左は空を切っていくこのジャブの打ち合いからボディー入ってきます1戦目になりますマスター前に出てくる不戦対戦つけてもらいたいのただあのちょっとパンチがあるのでマスターやっぱりそこでしっかりガードするボディーを見せていきましたワンツーから一人ストレート伸びていきますそのままどうですかあここも右のラブルを打っていくえぐるようなボディーフロー左ストレートパンチが伸びていきますでエロクラウンド始まりました。近い距離でマスターも戦ってきます。ああ、ただこれを落としての戦いになっています。さあ、この表情からして、マスターがどういうふうに、こういう成績のある人で。まあ、楽し、楽しいというか、いろいろやってみると、準々決勝。準決勝に勝ちそうなどちら、こちらは、もうすでにワンタン級日本王者でした。前に出てくるからもうあとこの7ラウンド8ラウンド2ラウンドを残しておいてどちらの選手なのかこれが日本あとそのどこで打てばいいかとか最初はちょっとこうパンチがあながら戦っているのかアンスー強烈,強烈ですねえーまたいこぶしもうまだ1分あるので、はい、でここはポツ選手はやっぱり少しクリーンですから左が切りました第7ラウンド、した第7ラウンド、左、引いた、引いた、安田さん、顔面捉えました、後半、特にこうあの流れをつかみ始めたところで、今、こうなってしまったんですけど、えー、あの